Oops. Hey guys, Chris McFree here. Welcome today to a new video. In this video, I'll show you guys part 2 of how to get ICS onto your Galaxy Tab P1000. Now, part 2 is slightly boring, so it's a little dry and stuff. Basically, for this video, I'm just going to show you guys um, how to back up your device and uh, how to back up your data so that you would be able to uh, make sure that you, your apps and your SMS and everything else is restored to your device before you actually uh, get ICS so that when you get ICS you can really put back your apps and you'll be happy and stuff. Alright, so two things you need. Number one, Titanium Backup. Just find it in the App Store. I, I'm in the uh, intro market, so it's called Titanium Backup Plus Roots. Let me just go a bit uh, over the focus. Very great. So Titanium uh, Backup Plus Root. So now, um, Titanium Backup Plus Root is a rather um, easy to use software. Basically, just download and install it. And just fo follow um, the instructions given when you, once you start it up. If you don't know how to use it, actually, you can just go to YouTube and search for more um, tutorials on Titanium Backup, and I'm sure you you'll find quite a few. Now, the thing is that Titanium Backup requires root. So, if you haven't rooted your device yet, then go root it and install Titanium Backup. The other thing is that if you guys um, don't dare to root the device to get Titanium Backup or anything else like that, then I would highly suggest you don't do ICS because. Um, installing ICS is much so called more difficult or uh, more challenging than actually rooting your device. So if you can't even have the courage or you can't have the ability to root your device, then I would really suggest you root your, you learn to root your device first and then do ICS. If not, yeah, in that order. Alright, next. Um, next, search for SMS Backup. And it's called SMS Backup and Restore. It's another free, pro uh, free software. Basically, same thing. It helps you to back up your SMS and restore it to the device after your I upgrade to ICS. Once again, I think this requires root, so you would definitely want to get root before using SMS backup and restore. Alright, so once you guys got these two apps and backed up all your uh, data, you can also use other applications. I'm just recommending this too. There are a lot, a lot of other videos on YouTube teaching you which are the best backup and restore softwares. Um, these are my two favorite, personal favorite. So get any SMS and uh, an, an SMS or app backup and restores you want. Back up all your data, or if you're thinking of getting a clean app, a uh, clean tablet, which is what I did, I didn't b bother restoring or backing up anything. I just deleted everything on my tablet and sent it back. If you're thinking of doing that, then by all means do that and don't back up anything. All right. So once you guys are ready, guys, if uh, you guys are sure that all your data is safe and secure, uh, go down to continue with part three, which I think is the link in the description below, and continue on with this video. So thanks for watching part two, and I'll see you guys in part.